so this is gonna be a pretty disappointing video for some um but i'm combing out my locks it's been three years and three years in september and honestly i i'm ready for a new look like these were cool these were fun these were new they were exciting but i they're damaged one they're damaged two i'm ready for a new look three it's just time it's really time i'm gonna show you guys like the damage that has been done not even it hasn't even been like because of the bleach or because of the dye you know it's literally been because i put my hair in ponytails a lot something that i've noticed about myself is that i've always just really wanted long hair i've always wanted to have a wonderful full ponytail like so i would put my bun or i put my i would put my locks in a ponytail a lot hold on so i would put my hair in this ponytail up here right just like so just like this and you see how my locks in the front and the perimeter they are extremely short they have broken off they got thin right obviously in these areas and they were the same length as everybody else all the other locks but this is the part of my hair that they would get into the bun so those areas like thinned out and it's not just these two i'll be very transparent and say like it's not just these two there's some more on this side hold on this one and i think this one too like they're just they literally thinned out and i combed them off like i was like no like they're just way too thin like they're gonna fall off anyway so i just combed them off um but that was like what made me um start wanting to comb my hair out but i've honestly just been going very back and forth with the entire idea of combing my hair out in the first place because i just want something new um it's been three years the locks were definitely a vibe i'm ready for some straight hair i'm ready for something different like i want even some braids and before y'all even get into the comments and say you can do all that you can you can get some braids over your locks i know i've done it before I don't want to do that anymore i just want my i want to feel my scalp i want to like go like this I, I i want my own hair okay and this was cool but that's the wonderful thing about hair is that we go through these phases or i go through these phases with my hair and then i switch it up every few years and that's just me and then that's the that's the style that i'm doing for the next few years and then it's on to something different that's the amazing thing about hair is that it's always going to grow back and I can always try something different. I just did a count. I have 89 locks total. Today's date is Wednesday, December 27th. And I have seen other people comb their locks out. And it's taken them weeks. It's taken them days. Um, I just watched West Indie Ray's video. And it took her like nine days. I'm trying to get this knocked out in like four. And I believe in myself. We love a delusional girly. I just really do not want to go into the new year with like a whole head of locks. And I just want to have my loose hair out. So, yeah. 89 locks. It's December 27th. It's 2.39 p.m. I have a water bottle with some water and conditioner in it. This is a conditioner I'm using for now. This is just like the conditioner that my boyfriend has. I need to get my own conditioner because um, I ran out of mine um so this is the conditioner i'm using for now and a rat tail comb oh so yeah let's get started i've got the back parted out already we're gonna start back there and let's get it okay this is the final hopefully you can see it yeah look at my locks and you stretch it all the way down it goes to here about bra strap length this one in the back i have combed out before because i was going to do this already before but i combed out this lock and i was like no no <laughs> so this is the one we started with at first and we're going to start with it again girl 
I just texted my boyfriend and was like, yeah, I'm about to start my uncombing my locks. He's like, are you sure? Positive, babe. Positive. I um combed my, my boyfriend's locks out to last, um, like around this time last year, like maybe October, December. Needs to saturate some more. Um, I did it. Oops. I'm about to put my Apple Watch in water mode. I can already tell this about to take but ever. Oh Lord. First lock down. That took 15 minutes and it was short. It was short. Look how short it is. 88 more to go, baby. This was all the hair that I lost from that one lock. Just a little, just a little, little ball. It has been two and a half hours. I've only done five. And this is basically it. You see? It's all I've gotten done in two and a half hours. <gasps> oh, it's gonna be a long, long, long week, probably. Okay, I look crazy, but it's 12.25, and all I've gotten done is that much. Actually, hold on. Okay, this is all that I have gotten done. I honestly don't even know how much that is. It looks about like maybe 10. <laughs> yeah, I've been working on this since 2.30 and it's 12.30. All I've done is, let me do an actual count. Okay, so I started out with 89. I just counted all that I had. I have 76 left, so that means I did 13 in 10 hours <laughs> oh my god and my finger hurts they were wrinkly a second ago but i gave myself a little break um and i'm about to go to bed because yeah and we'll be back in the morning good morning um it's 11 30 and it's day two and Let's see how much we can get done. Like I said last night, I only got like 13 done in 10 hours. We're gonna try to get more done today. Um, right now, I'm honestly just listening to this audiobook. Ooh, focus. Law of Attraction. Um, and it's been keeping me entertained um, while I do my hair. So, crack on the light. Oh, Lord. And we're back on day two. I came to the hair store because I just need to come to the hair store now. I'd rather like do what I need to do and then sit down and do, and be sitting down and combing my hair out for hours rather than like stopping and then leaving, go to the hair store and then go back. You know what I mean? Like I just rather get it all done first. Um, and I'm like wondering which products I should get. And I don't wanna like go back into the natural hair journey being a product junkie like so i'm just like what do i need and it's so hard because i'm at the hair store so obviously there's gonna be a shit ton of stuff here and i just like i have a wandering eye okay these are the things i got from the hair store a bonnet because i had a bonnet don't know where it's at some hair shears some edge booster this this edge booster is the only edge control that matters um, this is the conditioner I'm going to be mixing with my water, and I just got the matching shampoo, another comb, just in case this one breaks, that way if this one breaks, I've already got a second on hand, and I need an eyebrow razor as well. So we getting back into it, day two for real. It's currently 829 I have not gotten a lot done, honestly. Um, this was at 1.3 locks, I think. And then I probably did like four in the back. So it's averaging out to be about like 45 minutes to an hour per lock, which I think I'm going slower than yesterday. I have 68 left. <sighs> so in the past two days, I've only done 21. 22, wait, 89 minus 68, oh, I've only done 21. 
so in two days I'm only on 21 blocks. Hello, it's day three. Um, I love this body. <laughs> Anyways, it's day three, it's 2.59, three o'clock, and I haven't started at all. I had to go to my grandma's and like hang out with her and my brother for a bit. And so we're just now, we're having a very late start, but we're starting nonetheless. I'm honestly really over this whole process. I, I want to just cut it all off, but I can't do that, no, I can't do that. Um, so day three. Hey, so I only got nine done today. It's 11.30 and I'm tired and I wanna go to bed and I'm over this and my fingers are starting to hurt. Um, and I look like the little girl off the Polar Express. <laughs> um, but I this is what I got done so far. Let me push y'all up. We're making some headway, okay? Got the side, I got a couple in the front. Um, got my two little twisties out in the front out. And, oh wait, that's not one on my side. We're getting somewhere, I look insane. I'm basically taking my sweet time doing this process. Like you'd think because I'm trying to get it done that I would work harder and faster, but I'm not. Um, I'm actually avoiding it like the plague. I hate doing this. But yeah, beginning of day four. Let's see how many I get by tonight. My goal, my goal, I'm gonna stop at like around 12.30, probably one o'clock in the morning again. <laughs> but my goal is 15, maybe 20. Ooh, ooh, could we get 20? I don't know, maybe, maybe we get 30. It's like, <laughs> <sighs> I'm crazier and crazier every time. Um, send day four. It's 12.40, 12.54, almost one o'clock. And I have 39 left, and this is what we're looking like. We got the perimeter done. In this entire side. My boyfriend finally helped me with my hair today. My friends. My friends. My friends. My friends so yeah my boyfriend helped me so <laughs> hey day five we're actually starting pretty early in comparison to the other days that i've started it's 10 37 other days i've started at like two three so the fact that i'm starting like five hours earlier means we could get at least five more locks done right Okay, good morning. It is 10.36 and I'm pretty sure that this is day eight. I have 10 more. I am finishing today. This is what we're looking like. Um, we have the entire front done. The sides. Okay. And I just woke up so they're all bent and stuff when I was sleeping on them. So yeah, this is all that's left right here. Oh, what a time it has been. I have changed up my scenery because my back was killing me. Like sitting down in that chair, I've been sitting down in that chair for hours and every day. So I had to stand up in my bathroom. But I kind of just wanted to talk about my process of combing my hair out. Obviously I got my water and my conditioner. This is the conditioner I'm using. Um, I spray the whole thing down multiple times. As soon as it gets even like the smallest bit of um, dry, I respray it. And this is the controversial part because I think it's also because I'm almost done. I'm getting less patient. Um, so I'm honestly just hacking through this hair. Um, it's so coarse. It's like so time consuming actually most of the time i'm going like this i'm pretty sure like it's also like causing more breakage than necessary but at the same time it is just hair it's gonna grow back and that's been like the thing that's been keeping me solid this whole time because i honestly just want these out of my head i'm doing this process but it's not like with the most like the slightest of touch like i am just 
at first I was at first I was taking my time it would take me like an hour and a half to do like one lock and I think I've gotten it down to like one it's easier the skinnier locks are easier my hair is dry again the skinnier locks were easier um so I got through those quite fast I can get through those quite fast but when it's like like this is a thick boy but it's it's a thicker one. Oh, also like what makes this a difficult process for me is I have to do like two methods because I interlocked. If you can tell, so this is a normal part of my lock, right? Let's focus. But you can see like where there's these lines. That's like the interlock part. Like up here where it's like folding into itself. That's the interlocking part, right? And it's so hard going back and forth between like regular lock combing out so like hacking through it and um like trying to comb through the part I don't know it's just been like it's it's been a it's been a process and so that's why I feel like it's taking me like an hour to get through it this is all the hair that I lost it's a, basically a full bag source of hair anyone need an afro puff I got one for you. <laughs> I'm done. I look insane. But it is done, everybody. It's done. So, as you can see, my hair's got a lot of... It's not evenly blonde because that's, like, the darker spots is where, like, I had interlocked my hair. So, I'm gonna need to dye it. But... This whole process, y'all, took eight days. Eight long, long, strenuous days. My back hurts, my neck hurts, my fingers hurt. Can I see it on the camera? Yeah, I can see it on the camera. But yeah, guys, it was a process I honestly do not recommend, zero out of 10. If you're okay with just being bald headed, you should just cut your locks off rather than go through this whole process. Me, personally, I've already done the bald headed thing and I hated every moment of it. So that's why I decided to comb them out. But next time I get this idea, I'm just gonna go bald. If I ever get locks again and I wanna comb them out again, I'm just gonna go bald rather than do any of this myself again. Um, yeah, gotta dye my hair. That'll be in the next video. Oh, actually, something else. My head is so tender. I am so tender-headed now. Like, oh my god, it's crazy. Sean was um combing out my locks in the back. And, like, every time, like, he would comb up it. <gasps> and it just reminded me of, like, when you're a little kid and your mom was doing your hair. And, like, it hurt. So you're like, ow, ow, ow. And she's like, stop. You're not tender-headed. Stop being tender-headed. It just took me back to those times, those places, <laughs> that trauma. But yeah, y'all. Also, oh my goodness, let me show you guys for reference. I, this, this first part right here, not this, but this first part is what I had as my middle part for my locks. And then I was like looking at my head and I was like, wait, I think this is the middle. So this whole time I had like, it was like a half a centimeter off. And I thought it was the middle of my head, but it wasn't. So for three years, my middle part was not middle parting like I wanted it to. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, I am going to miss the locks. I kind of missed them already because I got to do my hair. But it's fine. We're in a new phase of our lives. And it's crazy because my hair just would go down like this. Now it goes, it won't stop going up. Okay, but yeah, thanks for watching everybody. Um, honestly, leave all the, if you guys wouldn't mind, please leave all the hate comments about don't comb your locks out and blah, blah. Just leave that, you know, like it's been done. I've done the natural hair thing. I've done the lock thing. Um, so it's, it's all good guys. It's really fine. It's just hair at the end of the day. Do what you want with your hair. I can't.
But yeah, look at my little pony. Pew, pew, pew. Little pony. <laughs> All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.